I realize, of course, that you are actually seeing this video on Wednesday, but as you can tell from my outfit, I actually filmed this the same day as I shot Tuesday's video, so same outfit. However, this is the things I'm into, which I took the idea from Christina Horner's channel because it seemed like a good idea. However, I do not have, as you saw me probably waving those expo markers around, I do not have fancy editing software. No, I have Windows Live Movie Maker. So instead of having fancy graphics to show the different categories of the things I've been into, I have a whiteboard that I actually just cleaned. The stuff that was on it was three months old. I had ink sitting on this whiteboard for three months. Have you ever tried cleaning that? Also, my voice is a sound effect. I have been into a lot of games this month. Firstly, the board game that I've been into this month is the Seafarer's expansion of Settlers of Catan. I like to consider myself a nice person, but I know that is not always the case, particularly when it comes to PvP situations. I am actually a very competitive person, which is why I love this game. You need the original Catan game to build the board for this game, but you also get to build boats, there is a pirate fleet. If you don't, the original Settlers of Catan game is you build an island with various resources all mixed up, and you and the people try to get to 10 victory points by building settlements and cities, and <clears throat> the Seafarers game has different setups. So you could have a setup that's actually four separate islands, you could have a setup where the pirate ship always moves. I've been playing my Star Wars The Old Republic account. It went free to play a few months ago, and... But honestly, the free-to-play system is really bad. Um, as if you, the free-to-play system is really bad if you were a subscribe, uh, if you were, if you've been a subscriber like I have been to the game at times. Um, although I don't think I would mind it so much if my friends hadn't decided to roll their characters on a PvP server. It's not really such a good MMO. But it's a really good RPG, and you essentially get eight different RPGs for free. So I've decided to play a little StarCraft 2. This game came out two years ago. The, the next part of the game, Heart of the Swarm, comes out on the 12th of next month, and I still have a couple missions left. So I've been working on that. I will have those missions done before Heart of the Swarm comes out. And the last video game that I have been playing is Pokemon Soul Silver on my DS. I, I seriously think I spent like three days just trying to catch Kangaskhan all day. You will be mine, Kangaskhan. And the next category is music! I have to admit, um, because I haven't been playing a lot of Warcraft, I've been listening to a lot of Warcraft parody music. And so as a result, I ended up subscribing to Silver Latomi's channel, who has a lot of World of Warcraft parody music. I think I listened to 30% Nerf for about a week. And she did a collab with another WoW parody artist, and they did a Battle Pets parody song to the original Pokemon theme. I find myself listening to a lot more video game music, particularly by the composer Nobuo Uemetsu, who did the final who did many of the Final Fantasy soundtracks and I found I have been listening to the Final Fantasy 4 and Final Fantasy 6 soundtracks. Did you see that? I don't know. I don't know if I turned that too fast. I haven't been able to get into Once Upon a Time since the mid-season break and by I haven't been able to get into, I mean I haven't actually been able to find the time to watch. So the only two things that I have been watching I've only actually started towards the end of February, is one, getting back into Castle since the season break, and secondly, I've been watching The Amazing Race in support of Joey Kersetha and Strawberry17, who are Team YouTube. Whoa! Internet stuffs. Spelled with a Z. Because I can. This would pretty much be every month since it came out, but I've been really into the Lizzie Bennet Diaries web series. So that was another thing I was into this month. And what else? Also, I've been using my Goodreads account more. Um, until tomorrow, TTYL.